Hello, my name is Juva and I'm here with Java the Hus to show you how to download and install Android Studios with the FTC SDK. Android Studios is an IDE or an integrated development environment used for Android development. An SDK or a software development kit is a software building tool for a specific platform. The FTC SDK contains the code to build the Android app, which allows you to control a first tech challenge robot. The first step is to make sure that you have Java installed on your computer and that it's up to date. Click the link in the description below or go to Java Oracle and click download Java. Choose your operating system and file type and click the link. Once it's finished installing, open the installer and click yes and then install. Now that we have Java installed, the next step to installing Android Studios is to open your browser and type in Android Studios, or click the link in the description below and click download. Once you're there, click the download Android Studios button and read and accept the terms and conditions, and then click download. Next, click install and it would take a couple minutes to install. And once you're done, click finish, choose the location of the download. I already have Android Studios download, uh, downloaded on my computer, so I'm going to click replace the previous version by checking this box. If you have other predefined settings, you can go ahead and import them, but I'm just going to continue without them for the purpose of this video. Once you have the program installed, go to your browser and type in FTC Freight Frenzy SDK or go to the link posted in the description below. At the time of making this video, the SDK for, power play, for the Power Play season has not been released yet, however the process is the same for all versions. Click Code, and then click Download Zip. Once you've downloaded the zip folder, go to your file explorer and unzip the folder by clicking on the folder, right-clicking and clicking Extract All. Make sure to note down the location of this file, and then go to Android Studios and click Open. Locate the, un the unzipped folder that you, um, you did a couple minutes ago, select it, and click Open. This will take a couple of minutes for the SDK to load in. Make sure that you're in the Android Project tab in the top left, otherwise the project will not load properly. Android Studios will most likely prompt you to install some additional packages, so go ahead and accept the terms and conditions and install those packages. Once everything is loaded in, go to your team folder, then click Java, org.firstinspires, and right click that package, and then type in uh, teleop. This will create a subfolder to store your all your teleop programs, and then right click on that teleop folder, click new, and Java class. Type in whatever you want to name your teleop program. I'm going to be calling it sample teleop for, the, for this video. Now that the environment is set up, you're all ready to start coding. If you've enjoyed this, please show your support and look forward to upcoming videos.